Hey, Jackie K here, and I'm here to bring you my LP of what I think is one of the greatest games of all time. Eh, at least the top ten for me. And over here we have, and he'll be co-commentating along, all that good stuff. So, with that, let's begin! So, we're going to start a new game. Yes. I know I'll delete the old save file, so that's okay. One click now, and we'll be on the way of deciding our name. So, what should we go with? Why only one of the greatest names of all time? <laughs> I kid. Eh, I guess it would seem kind of stupid to some people, but I, it wouldn't be tradition to me without calling myself Jacket. And for some reason I want to find some arbitrary symbol to use. H here, that'll do. So let's watch the opening. <sighs> lovely ship. In a lovely place. Libra. Libra. What says one to two on there? Scrolling around. Nothing bad is gonna happen. But wait! The music is changing! Oh no! Helicopters are flying around the ship! Oh no! A shadow? What could it possibly be? This is madness! This is so obvious! <laughs> oh no! It's gonna lift the ship up. Well, and how did I know it's gonna lift the ship up? I'm psychic. Yeah, you know what those two are probably saying. Boss? Yeah. You won't know something? Yeah. It's kind of strange when the ship got left and all that. Yeah. But how are we supposed to get back to land? Well, they're screwed. But enough about them. It's time for us. Oh, we got a sailor man. I can't believe it. Knows all these great moves and so many amazing stuff. This is gonna be a wonderful game already. Go ahead, sledge bomb me. Like I'm gonna care. Ooh, so scared. Cause I'm gonna finish you off next turn. Earthquake! And hurrah for our level 50 Samus. I mean Salamence. Yeah, you lost. Yeah, we won. Alright, Jacob, this will do for today. Huh? Yes, sir, that was a well played battle. Jacob, your skills have improved by an amazing amount. Wait, so this was all a simulation? And I don't get to keep the salamis? What a ripoff! Yeah, so we have an Eevee. Well, that's not so bad. Eevee's pretty cute. Race Pokemon besides Eevee? Sure. But isn't this our arena? Where are we gonna find Pokemon like that? Oh, hi, guy. Hmm. Oh. Uh. Something tells me that this is where we should go. Oh, hi, Jacket. Have you finished training? Jacket, this is the director's office. Did you want to pay for visit to Professor Crane? Ah, <laughs> you don't need to be that stiffly official, Lily. But... Oh, yes. I heard from the battle coach was singing high praise about you, Jacket. I heard that your battle skills have improved dramatically recently. That's outstanding. I don't think I slammed much of a chance against you. Haha. <laughs> I wish everyone would stop drowning him in praise so much. My son and daughter would become spoiled rotten. There's nothing to it. They're both wonderful kids. By the way, I don't think I've seen Jovi since lunchtime. Jacket, I hate to bother you, but could you find Jovi for me? Sure. Yeah, you're real busy. No! Don't be so rebellious. Go find her. Fine. Okay. After five long years, this five project is on the verge of coming together. 
that to happen, we can't do it without your mother's expertise. Oh yes, I left a P-Star DM in your room, Jackie. Go check it out. P-Star DA stands for Pokemon Digital Assistant. So they're a useful electronic tool. Okay, so P stands for Pokemon, D stands for Digital, A stands for Assistant. But what does the star stand for? What does the star stand for? Do not think it stands for PK Star Storm. <sighs> nice guess, so. Oh well. I guess the first place to go to then is our room. So down the elevator. Hmm. Is this our room? Um. I mean the pulse. Oh, you haven't seen your son punch either? Oh, I guess this is our room. <laughs> Kids sister repairs to have to run into place. Oh! Shiny thing! On the desk! But I'm gonna go get these potions first, cause I can. I'm rebellious like that. Now we get it. P Star DA. You got mail. If you're reading this email, then you must know the team the P-Star DA. Try out spending features. By the way, Odin was playing hide and seek with Jovi. Why not have a chat with him? Sure. You know, this is one of the most frustrating moments of the game, believe it or not. He's a really good hider! Uh... Not like I got lost or anything. So, let's go find him. Oh, you're not telling that story again, are ya? Fine. <sighs> okay, I admit, it took me two hours to find him the first time I played this game. But there he is, right there on the desk. Oh! A Calgon is high there! Oh! Wow. He's even better hidden than the guy. I just noticed that. Oh! You startled me! Oh, it's just you, Jacket. You're looking for Joey? We've both been playing hide and seek right now, but she isn't around anywhere. Maybe you should go on to Dr. Kami Gill's manor. There's a big weird house southeast of here. Jovi's sitting in our game of hide and seek. I wish she'd find me soon. My back's starting to hurt. <laughs> you gotta left him. Oh, what do you want? Oh, commotion. Maybe something big's on the TV. This is OBN yes, news. Furries few still have failed to find any traces of the cargo ship SS Libra since its sudden disappearance off the coast of Gate the Empire. There have been no reports of Swellsmen indicating the ship's sinking. The authorities appear mystified by the way the ships vanish like smoke. The reports of that numerous Pokemon were on board. Concern is rising over their welfare. Whoa, a cargo ship carrying Pokemon disappeared without a trace? Is that really true? I guess. So... I guess that's where we gotta go next, Dr. Kamikios Manor. So we'll just... Head on out. But just one little thing that I... Want to check, just for the heck of it. Really, I didn't realize that Kelgon was here out of all the years I've been playing. Seems like I... Says I'm starting to LP, I'm discovering new things every day. Huh? Here at the Pokemon HQ Lab, we undertake a great variety of research on Pokemon, from their ecosystem to the battling. Oh, it's you, Jack. You scared me on my wits. So yeah, in the next part, we shall head to Dr. Kamikyo's lab. So, see you all next time. Bye!